Irving Allison after a two-nil defeat against Bishop Stalks in the fourth qualifying round of the Emirates FA Cup. Ian, how do you sum that up? A um, little bit disappointed. Um, it, it's, it's strange because I felt first half we played very, very well and uh, we found ourselves 2 0 down very, very quickly. Um, first goal, you've got to say that's, that's good play from them. They've closed the keeper down really well. I think Riyad took a little bit longer than he should have done. I don't think he realised that he was going to be closed down. And something you've seen it, they could go anywhere. And then the second goal, one, one long ball. And I need to see the video because it shouldn't be beating us from one long ball. And, uh, we found ourselves 2 0 down, yet we'd hit the post and, and we've had two or three really good chances. Uh, I've had text messages after the game to say it was a penalty on Zane, he should have gone down. Um, and so we started really well, and yet we find ourselves 2 0 down. I said to the lads at half time that we probably had sort of 65 70 percent possession. We'd actually looked okay, and I, I think if we just get a goal back in the first 15 20 minutes, we're in this a bit like we was against Stebb's fleet. Um, but I don't think we really turned up. To give them a bit of credit, they got bodies behind the ball. They, they tried to protect their lead. Um, they didn't try and come out too much unless it was going to be a, um, a counter attack. And I just felt we, we played a little bit into their hands. I think we played a little bit too long. Um, we tried to force everything. Um, long throws, everything that we, we, we haven't been doing good this year. Um, we got into some really poor habits, I felt, second half. And they're the things we've got to try and sort out before a weekend. Because I think with the players we've got, if we can get the ball down, pass it and move it and get people around their backs to their full backs and get crosses in, we can cause teams problems. But I felt they were comfortable with the way we, we handled the situation in the second half. We kept going the longer two centre halves dealt with everything we put forward. Um, so you've got to say full credit to them. You know, they've, they've done their job. They, they've won the game. Uh, and we have to, you know, look forward to Saturday now and make sure that we, we put it right on Saturday. As you said, we created those sort of chances, but second half we just didn't really get going, did we? We didn't really come out, I think, like what a lot of fans expected us to. I think you've got to give them a bit of credit because they defended in numbers. Um, they, they say they left the lad up front on his own. They didn't try and get anyone in touch with him. They got everybody behind the ball. Um, and that's where we needed to have a little bit of quality, I felt, and a little bit of craft. And you know, maybe a David Noble might have got on the ball and made things long, but he's injured, so we have to, we can't do anything about that. We have to. We have to get on with what we've got um, and, and we've got good players and I just said to the players there, what disappoints me, we've got players that, that can do that and I didn't think we did that in the second half. I felt we got sucked into into trying to force it and force it and force it and I think maybe if we'd have relaxed just a little bit more on the ball, we, we'd have done better than what we did. As I say, we started to throw the ball in the box and we didn't win. I don't think we won one header from a long throw. Why we started to throw it in, I, I don't know. We, we should. You know, go short to go long or go long to go short and but we didn't we just kept going long 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 and, and it become just they, they were comfortable in the way we played the second half you mentioned those injuries david <coughs> noble and michael johnson obviously both missing both key absentees how are they looking yeah they've both got five injuries um i think five games in in the two week period has caused a bit of a problem um it, it, michael's obviously doing a lot of kicking off the floor uh, and david is just not really we've not really recovered from the mickle over game so it's one of them, we can take chances with them, but again, if you take a chance and, and, and they do the uh, the thigh muscle, you know, they're going to be out for probably 12 weeks rather than at the moment, hopefully two weeks. So it's a difficult one, but you have to accept injuries. We've got a big enough squad, the squad's good enough, um, and we have to accept it and we have to get on with it. And obviously, now tension turns to the league, no more cups to concentrate on apart from the trophy. Well, exactly, I mean, but that's going to happen in a couple of weeks' time. Um, I'm not quite sure what the draw was tonight. I don't know who, if we'd have got through, who we'd have got. Um, but that's gone now, so we can't worry about that. We have to concentrate on, on chipping them now. Um, and then we've got you know, quite a tough November. We've got some tough games. We've got four or five games coming in that period. So we've got to maintain the status where we are in the league. Um, we said we don't want a, a reoccurrence of what happened last year. We're better than that. Um, and, and as I say, the players are better than what they've shown tonight. And that disappoints me a little bit um, because we're a better side than that. Brilliant. Thank you very much, Ian. No problem. Thank you.